Hey y'all, happy Sunday. I hope everyone has a wonderful day. Now, yes, it is amazing to me that people continue to talk about Charlene. They continue to say, how can people talk about a black woman, put a black woman down? Even on Everyday PJ's slides that he did yesterday, a woman got on there talking about, why are you talking about a black woman? Who am I speaking with? Yeah, just taking views from PJ. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm calling about, I'm calling about every time I come on your channel, all this negativity about one black woman. What's going on? So, so what is this all about? It's not even, wait, wait, first of all, it's not even about a black woman. It's not even, I don't even, I don't, I don't talk about her as a black woman. I don't even talk about her children. I don't even talk about her children. And it's in everybody's comments that speaks on Charlene and her crazy behavior. So my thing is, how can you even say she's a black woman when she doesn't even consider herself a black woman? Like, don't project how you see her instead of realizing how she thinks of herself. She has clearly told everybody that she is what her father is, who was Mexican and Hawaiian from what she knows, from what her mother told her, obviously. But you know, she does not claim to be a black woman. You don't believe me? Well, listen to this. Somebody said, what are you mixed with? Well, my mom, she is black and Indian, Cherokee Indian. And my dad, he is Mexican and he's Hawaiian. And if you guys don't know, you are what your father is because you come from your father. Basically, your mom just carries you. So if you didn't know that, you are what your father is. My father is Mexican and Hawaiian. So I guess that's why I'm so light skinned. Not really dark, you know, but uh, yeah, if you didn't know that, I'm telling you now. You are what your father is. You come from your father. Your mother just carries you. So all the black women out there that support Charlene, just know that she does not believe she is the same as you. She's a light-skinned Mexican and Hawaiian woman. She does not claim to be black. You can continue to stick up for her, but saying that everybody's talking about a black woman, no, she doesn't even believe that. She's Mexican and Hawaiian, okay? Now, there are also some people that say, yes, she is correct, you are what your father is. Now, for all the people that are mad that people criticize Charlene's crazy behavior, um, you have to have another argument now. It's not because she's a black woman, because she said she's not. So, let's believe her then. If she thinks she's Mexican and Hawaiian, and she is what her father is, then okay. So, I guess we're criticizing a Mexican and Hawaiian woman. Now, I also wanna bring up this video when I started to realize Charlene is really not that great to Kamari. And I think a lot of other people realized it in this moment as well, so watch this. Hey, yeah. Yo, CJ. CJ, your sister. Gotta get him a hug. Oh, snap, CJ, remember you. It's so dark out here though, Kamari. My bad, I ain't got no lights yet. Where they at? Hi, Kamari, so you out here with the kids? Hey, hey. Oh, we got gave the sister a hug. Oh, why you out here like that, Mari? Wow. Y'all see how the brothers and sisters treat each other. They bogus, man. It's cool, though. Kamari just got here. We're going to let them settle in. She back and shot. She said, hi, sister. There ain't no way. She said, hi, sister. She said, hi, sister to me. Hi, sister. Come on, go down to me. Hey, hi, sister. Airplane? Get it. All right, man. We go actually. Did you, you got to see the rest of the house, Kamari? You want to see the upstairs? Kamari, oh, no. she ain't listening to me, man. Kamari, oh, you want to go upstairs and see the rest? All right. We're going to do the whole tour then. Kamari had just came to the house. Like, just got there. And Charlene just stands there like she's a stranger. Carnation was the only child that was really excited to see her. Imagine having to live in the house with this woman who clearly does not like your mother and it's rubbing off on her not liking you as well. Now to further prove that Charlene does not believe that she is black, even if her telling you in that video that she is Mexican and Hawaiian, if that's not enough, listen to this clip. 
quick look at these peanut butter guts. God damn. Sexy, sexy. You know, man, I've always wished I could afford a foreign car, you know? I've always wanted something foreign and sexy. But man. Mm, mm, mm. Well, Royalty thinks she's just what I was referring to. She thinks she's that foreign sexy thing I was looking for. The woman believes she is foreign. Didn't she say her family is from New Mexico? <laughs> wow. And this is just another example of how she was always competing with everything as far as getting CJ's attention. She's in competition with everything, even cars. <laughs> so in conclusion, Charlene doesn't even believe she's black. She's Mexican and Hawaiian like her father is. So if you're going to be mad about people talking about her, you have to find a better argument than she's a black woman because she clearly isn't. Even though she did say her mother is black and Indian, she believes she is what her father is. Y'all have got to let me know down in the comments what do you think about the situation? Do you think Charlene is black still? Or do you believe what she says about herself and saying that she's Mexican and Hawaiian? Also, are you supporting Charlene because you have been through a similar situation and you wish it could have turned out better? I believe if Charlene would just get into some counseling because she says she was in an abusive relationship before CJ. So if she would get into some counseling, she would do better. Think about it. She would have a counselor that would tell her what she has done wrong and why she entered into relationships that were toxic. And then she would be able to do better. But until she realizes that her actions are getting her in trouble, she will never get better. Just let me know all of your thoughts and opinions in the comment section. Thank y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will definitely see you in the next one. I worked overtime and I never was there to see my kids. And the first thing I did when I saw you was what? When we went on our date. That I don't want to work no more. She didn't want to work anymore. I she wanted, wanted to be at home with my Stay kids. at home. This is what she did. She, I wouldn't say complained, but she complained about how she was tired of working so many years up until she met me. And it was kind of like she was like, can you take care of me. I trust you to take care of us because I'm tired. And, and when I saw her, I'm like, I'll do anything for you. So I made a promise to her. I'm like, I promise you, I'm gonna take care of all of y'all. This was a long time ago and- Hey. So, so I wanna um, get up here and you know, just say hey. But um, girls, so um, I'm a, I'm a girl. No, I'm just playing, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a boy, but I am a girl, but I am a, you know, yeah. Mm -hmm. So can you add my sister up here? Like she just like we are gonna do it together. Okay, what's her nine bands fam? Oh, all these people. I don't think. Oh wait, I actually just found it. It's right there. <laughs> That's like about I'm a fag. Oh, why is y'all saying that? Hi, Julia girl. <laughs> you know me. The one I think so. Yeah, you should yeah. probably be back, but um, can we like so no tea, right? Mm -hmm. No tea, right? No. You know what I mean? <laughs> Girl, that's that's you know what you not like what you say. You know like. what I mean? Wait, what? No tea, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> we came for you. I right, we gonna sing then. I like to yeah. play act some instrument. Okay, so what's your favorite song, Julia? Um, I like "Fight the Feeling" by Raw Wave. Okay, I'm a rap. I'm doing a freestyle. Okay. okay. Oh, so you listen to Raw Wave? Okay. Are you feeling your drop. feelings? Okay. okay, since I'm out the rap, you ready? Not really, but okay. Huh? Okay, because okay, girl, I be in my feelings every day. For the haters, for the haters. Y'all ready? Okay, right, let's wrap. Play Axel Instrumental. Here's Axel. Okay. Instrumental remix. I am hey, you gonna go first, sister? I go second. Okay. Come on. Okay. Do you hear? Okay. Yeah. Mm, don't laugh, Julia. <laughs> yeah, my name is Dan. You're not very fucking good. What you gonna do? I'm gonna punch you in your face. All that hating. Can't even rap. Like, what you gonna do? And I never kept. You got your leader. Yes, sister. Look, guys, there's some Dia. Sorry, Dan. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. <laughs> oh.
Um, so. My bad, Julia, you, Julia, you lagging. I am. Girl, yeah, it's okay though. Lot, Girl, it's not lagging that bad though. It's not lagging like bad. And you got, you got somebody. Oh. Else on the live, we gotta leave for it to um do it because it's glitched. Okay, so we start the live. So it said this girl, the girl, yeah, it still says girl up here, but you can add us, add us back because I, I need to.